I'm pro Muay Thai fighter DJ Miller, and this is Cameron. This video is for Sean Fagan and Knock My Nation. Today we're going to be going over trigger moves. Now what we just did was our freestyle pad work and there was a lot of activity but there was no vocals whatsoever. Everything was based off of a certain subtle movement that I do that camera can catch on that way she knows the next punch coming or next combination coming. The first trigger move I'm going to do is called the uh, jab cross hook without me saying it. So I'm going to get camera started with a one two. So now it's nice and fresh and everything. Now look closely after the one two. I will flick my wrist. She'll catch that during the punch or after the punch is done and she'll know that immediately to follow up with a left hook. So we're going, she's going to look for that flick. Alright, and that's how I can tell her the one, two, three is next without actually saying it. So this is great when you're backstage fighting or you're in a crowd and you really can't hear your partner. You use these subtle movements to make them know that the next punch is coming. The next trigger move is going to be the uh, body shot block, okay? Now what Cameron does from this one, she blocks the body shot by putting her elbow down and immediately follows up with these punches, the uppercut, hook, cross, okay? Every time I hit that body, she blocks. She will always follow up with those three punches. And what that's gonna do is help your reaction time and your countering time to come in. Alright, this is all her reading this punch coming down, and this is going to create great muscle memory. So, I'm going to put those two together to make her flow a little bit better. So, we're going to get going with this one, two. She looks for the movement. Okay, and that's that body shot, uppercut, hook, cross. Right, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and like to learn more from top fighters and coaches, please follow knockmynation.com. Also, leave a comment down below for suggestions for any more future videos. Thanks again. So, from the top, I'm going to get going with my first couple trigger moves. 